Meanwhile, Governor Walker made his first public comments on the issue today since marriages began. He mentioned that he voted for the gay marriage ban in 2006, and he says his personal opposition doesn't matter because the ban was passed by voters. We take an oath of office, and as part of that oath, we're obligated to uphold the Constitution of the state. This isn't just a rule. This wasn't just a law. This is in the state's Constitution as enacted by the voters of the state. Walker's likely opponent in the gubernatorial election this year chimed in today. Mary Burke released a statement saying, finally recognizing that committed, loving Wisconsin couples have the freedom to marry whomever they choose represents an important step forward in our state.